Hi Capricorns, this week we have got the end of Mercury retrograde. So Mercury stations direct as of this week and it is the last planet to do so. So we have had a lot of planets retrograde recently, including Venus, and these are now all over. So all planets direct means that we are gonna have a little bit more clearer motivation, more clearer thinking, more clearer communication with people around us. Maybe we'll be able to speak a bit more directly. Maybe we'll also have more ability to kind of organize ourselves like on a day-to-day -day basis our schedules and our routines and you know all those little tasks that during mercury retrograde we go like oh god i'm so overwhelmed don't know what to do so for you in particular capricorn this is a really powerful time for you to just take stock um, of what you've been learning over the past few weeks with mercury retrograde and venus retrograde um, and to say to yourself you know where am i improving what challenges did I face over the last few weeks? Uh, were there any challenges in my communication? Were there any challenges in my organization? Were there any challenges in my own mindset, the way that I view the world? Um, and how can I adjust those? Because actually that's really what a retrograde is all about. It's about how do I adjust these things? How do I slow down and pay attention enough that I can just make some little small changes that would make vast improvements in my life? So let's see what cards you've got. Okay, we've got the Queen of Wands and the Four of Swords. Um, so for some of you, there is a need to slow down, as I said, to take a pause, take a rest, maybe do some meditation, and to also really use that to kind of power your confidence, to power your energy. The Queen of Wands always suggests be, being very vibrantly you, uh, be, be, the, being very authentic and really expressing yourself. That might be through creativity, might be through connection with other people. Uh, you might want to get out in the sunshine if you've got any um, and really try to allow yourself to rest and play. And um, this is going to really balance out all of the other energies that we've had recently. So guys, definitely come next week because we've got a Valentine's Day special on where I'll be doing lots of extras. And yeah, if you want to book a reading or uh, yeah, check out the blog, there is a link below. Much love.